This is Chris, Reading Coalition for the Homeless. And we're here in downtown Reading on Pine Street. And we can see a woman that is suffering, laying literally in the snow. Had to sleep in the snow here. Uh, must have had eight inches of snow on her yesterday morning. You can see here sleeping on the concrete. Uh, where is this so-called CERT team that comes and helps homeless folks? Where is the millions and millions of dollars that the city of Reading has received and Shasta County has received to help homeless folks? I would assume, especially with mental health issues. I'll call the CERT uh, or the uh, people there on Gold Street and have her checked. I hope she's alive. I'm afraid to go over there and look, to be quite honest with you. She's under that blanket. I think it's a she. I'm not sure. She's been here for days. Is there anything we can do besides handing this poor homeless person a card and saying the Good News Rescue Mission is here and the Salvation Army is there? Is a CERT team capable of doing anything for this poor homeless woman that has been here for months? Rain, sleet, snow, right on Pine Street, mind you. How many churches are there in the city of Reading that we let this go by day after day after day and let our city and county administrators get away with taking millions of dollars and not helping people like this? It's an absolute abomination. And restart Reading is a joke. They're giving, probably giving that money to the police to have the homeless shuffled from one end of town to the other over and over. I wouldn't trust the Good News Rescue Mission if you could throw them. This is the suffering that's going on here. This is what happens. And I want to remind my listeners too, there are homeless children that have uh, slept and stayed out in this snowstorm. I have personally talked to Child Protective Services and uh, you know, as long as they're fed and long as they're kept warm, we don't care, blah, blah, blah. That's another abomination that we shouldn't be allowing here. Where is Channel 7 News? Where is the record search light? Where is a news cafe? I'm sitting here screaming and this woman is not getting up. I hope she's not dead. I don't have a cell phone, so I'm going to go home and I'm going to call the Hope Band. I'm going to call the other folks. I'm going to call and have this poor woman checked on. Uh, I'm scared to death for her health and her well-being. How can Reading be blessed when we leave people out on our streets like this in a snowstorm to sleep on the concrete? The Reading police chief doesn't give a shit or shinola about the homeless. God almighty, I wish we had Chief Hanson. This would not be here. This wouldn't be here with Roger Moore either. A good Christian police chief would not allow this to be laying out in the streets. A good uh, police chief and a good city, a Christian city administrator, manager, would not let this person freeze here day after day after day. I'm beside myself. If I took every homeless person that I saw struggling like this over the years, I'd have a house full of dead people. We need more adequate shelter. We need to help these people besides letting them languish out in the streets waiting for Restart Reading. For a bunch of people, a bunch of so-called spark plugs are going to start Restart Reading. I don't know how you Restart Reading with a bunch of dead spark plugs that have just failed year after year after year. And they're probably taking millions of dollars to do it. Chris, Red and Coalition for the Homeless. God bless in Jesus' name.